let us proceed to the next problem. Okay, your next problem natin is a we have a circuit here. Consider the circuit in this figure under DC condition. I'll take note, ha? Under DC condition ulit tayo, no? Ano ba ang under DC condition na nangyayari sa kapasitans? May kapasitans ba? Okay, that is open circuit. Kapag naman sa inductor, shorted siya. Okay, so kapag re-redraw mo to, open ito, tapos ito, shorted. A, hanap natin yung I, B sub C, open circuit, and I sub L. And then next is D, energy stored in the capacitor and in the inductor. So, ito na yun, ni-redraw siya, no? Ito na yung ating solution. Sabi ko nga, under this condition, open circuit C, capacitor. Ito, open circuit. Open circuit. Si inductor naman, shorted. Kaya shorted siya, no? Kailangan tandaan yan. It is for under DC condition. So, from here, dun tayo magsasolve ng unknown. I, V sub C, I, V sub C, and I sub N. Tapos yung mga energy stored. <clears throat> okay. Analyze natin. So, kung hahalapin natin yung I, ito open to. Walang drop dito. So, yung I natin, diretso lang siya, no? So, yung I natin, tali ganito siya. Twelve volts. Tapos meron tayo dito ng mga elements. Shorted ito. Meron kang one ohm at saka five ohms. Ininiglek na natin to kasi yung current na dadaan dyan. Pero may open circuit voltage ka. Tapos ito na yung I. Okay. Ito na yung I natin. That is I. So yung I natin our I is equivalent to 12 volts. Okay, 12. Ano lang, ohms lang. 1 plus 6. So, that is 2 ampere. Ayan na. Ganyan lang kasimple. Okay, next, ano ang hahanapin natin? D, V of C. 4 V sub C. The open circuit voltage. Kung E, okay, i-redraw natin. B sub C. Ayan. Draw-drawing ko lang uli, no? Ito, hihilain natin siya papunta doon. So, ito na yung 5. Five ohms, one. Tapos meron tayo dito twelve positive negative twelve volts, and then four. Tapos V sub C positive negative. Sis walang voltage drop dito, walang drop jan zero. Therefore, yung V sub C natin equal siya sa drop dito kay five, which is five times an current na dada anjan times I. Tama, yung current kasi dito is I. So, V sub C is 5 times 2. V sub C is 10 volts. Okay. Next is yung I sub L. Ano yung I sub L? I sub L is equal to I is equal to I sub L. That is also yung dadaan na current dito, di ba? Yung dadaan na current dito, diretso kay 1, 5, walang dadaan na current dito, open circuit yan. So, I sub L is equal to I, which is equal to 2 ampere. Okay, next, for W, C, and W, L. W, C is equal to 1 half. Okay. 1 half C, V, um, squared. Ito, P sub C, yan. So, W, C is 1 half. Ano yung capacitance natin? 1 Ano yung V sub C natin? 10 squared. So, WC is 50 joule. And then, for WL, 1 half L I squared naman yon. So, 1 half L is the inductance is 2. And yung I natin, which is equal to I L, yung dadaan dito na current, that is equal to 2. Squared. So that is equal to equals to 4 joules. Ayan. So, madali lang, no? Basta kailangan tandaan 
open circuit kapag DC ang source, open circuit ang volt ang capacitor, shorted naman ang inductor. Okay? So, let us proceed for our last problem. Okay. So, ano to? Okay. So, yung last problem natin is a problem on inductor pa rin. So, for the circuit in figure, this is the figure, we have to Ito, I of T. So, sulat natin yung given. I of T. I of T is equal to 4, 2, minus E negative 10 of T. This is in milliamp. Tapos, I of 2 of 0. So, medyo linawin natin ang mata natin. Negative 1 milliamp. So, find A, I 1 of 0. Tapos B, V of T. Tapos V1 of T. At saka yung V2 of T. Tapos C, I1 of T. And I2 of T. Okay. So, solution. Okay. <clears throat> so, una kailangan natin yung I of I sub 1. Okay, so based from the circuit, kung I kasi natin, I, yung I kasi natin is equal to I1 plus I sub 2. Tama? So kung I of 0, that is I1 of 0 plus I2 of 0. So kailangan natin is for A, I1 of 0. Tama? So yung I1 of 0... Ito is equal to I of 0 minus I2 of 0. Yung I of 0, meron bang given? Wala tayong given I of 0. Okay. Yung I of 2. Wait lang. Since I of 2 of 0, given to eh. Ito, negative 1 milliamp. Since for I of 0, di ba meron tayong equation na I, I of T at any time T is 4, 2, negative, yan. Yan. For I of 0, so I of 0, 4, 2 minus E negative 10 of 0. Ayan. This is equivalent to E raised to 0 is 1. So I I of 0 is 4, 2 minus 1. I of 0 is 4, 4. 4 milliamp. Ayan. So, yan ang gagamitin natin. Tsaka to. So, therefore, I1 of 0 is equal to I of 0, which is 4 milliamp, minus ito, ito. Ito yung ano natin, yung gagamitin natin yung equation. Ito given. I of I2 of 0 is given. Yung I of 0, ito, dinarrive natin by substituting uh, 0 for time t. So, 4 minus negative 1 milliamp. So, I1 of 0 is equal to 5 milliamp. And we have to remember this I1 of 0. Okay, let's proceed to second. Unknown. Okay, yung second natin is, ano yung mga unknown? V of T, V1 of T, V1 of 2. Yung V of T, total 1, saka 2. Okay. Kamali pa ako dito. So, kailangan kopihin ko dito ito. Ito. Aha. Okay. Kailangan natin. I think kailangan akong i-redraw. 
Dilitro ko na lang. So this is to Henry. Four. 